Alive everywhere. See if your shit can pick that shit up, dog. The feet? Or the yeah. questions? Yeah, oh, because of how we couldn't do it last time? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me see. G, you got a, uh, an extension? An extension. You got one over there? Is it, are you a fuck shit? Uh, oh, yeah, you're in there. There's one right here, too. Yeah, baby. It was cold as fuck. I left my phone in the car while I was at work. And I literally came out. My screen had ice on it, like the window. And, shit. and my phone ain't been acting right ever since. So I don't know what the hell happened. Yeah, that's fucked. Right like I had right? to scrape my, my screen though. Yeah, we ready? Right. sound nice almost there we go yeah i can hear you though there we go i guess we're on local celebrity okay. radio show episode number what the fuck we don't even know yeah. it's your man deputist aka davy wad aka Depp ass grills aka d's and t's and your meezies aka let's get it yeah it's your boy beasley of course as fuck AKA. went out last night should have went out but still making moves St. Paul, what up? Good morning. A Minneapolis. A Shut the fuck up. AKA, AKA, AKA um, too old to go out. AKA, I'm hired on permanently now. No more temp jobs. AKA. AKA. Uh, AKA. AKA, if I talk to your mother and she tells me what's up, I'm going to yell what's up back to her. That's what it is. And we got a guest today. My man. Yeah. What up? Uh, I don't got all these AKAs. You gotta come up with, come up with come something. Up with a, come up with an AKA. I did drink in the morning. AKA G Cole. AKA say G Cole. AKA I don't smoke, but I smell like it. AKA I don't like cocaine, just love the smell of it. AKA. <laughs> <laughs> AKA, why ain't y'all been at the shows? AKA, it don't matter. AKA, when I come back, y'all gonna have to pay for the shows. No free tickets. What's up? Yeah, I like that. The fuck does cocaine smell like? I got no idea. It smells like. Are you uh, high after that? Yeah, you smells, gotta be high after. Smells that. like ether. That's ether. Ether. You gotta put that microphone in the middle. We gotta. We gotta yeah, share, we gotta share, share. our mics. We share it today. It's gonna be like uh like like three part harmony on the microphone. Right, like right. Temptations. Right. I That's come in. Right. I pop out. You go in. Right. Right. You know what I'm That's the new addition. The new addition to the new addition story. The new addition to the new addition right, story. Right. 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 We never we never talked about that on the show, man. Did y'all? I know y'all watched the new edition. What did you think about that? I thought that shit was good. I, I, uh, you didn't watch it? it? Oh, uh, man. Nah, I got BET. You ain't got BET? Compared to, like, no, the shit was being compared to The Temptations and, uh, the, and uh, the Five Heartbeats. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, shit was dope. Though. It's comparable, man. Very. It's very comparable. I thought it was dope. It was, was dope. really good, actually. You know, the only, the, the main fucked up thing about the whole movie was the commercial breaks. <laughs> like, the commercial breaks were out of control. There was a, uh, I think it was episode two. Yeah. You know, I watched it on DVR and it was literally a commercial every seven minutes. I was gonna say every five minutes. Yeah, it was two like, hour, it'll be two like hour one, episodes, but yeah, literally yeah, it it'll was be like forty-five minutes. One scene and then a commercial break. Commercial break. Then they'll do like two scenes, commercial, commercial. break. Exactly. <laughs> like, it was a that lot shit of was out of control. So I want to see the movie 
when it's officially released, like yes. a movie type with no right. commercial. Yeah. DVD, I'll buy it. So I can fully enjoy it. The shit was it. dope as fuck, though. Like, I thought it was real. Minus, minus, all the, minus all the distractions. Yeah. One of, I thought it was one of the best real life to movie. Bio, bio right, 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 right. I, Musical. Think, I think yeah. so, too, man. I, I was trying to I was trying to compare it, like you said, the the, uh, the Fire Heart Beats. Um, right, right. Um, uh, the Temptation movie. Yep. And Ray. Those would probably be like my top Some three of the top, musical yeah. biopics. Right. And Hey, it, it was up. It was up that shit was up. Yeah, yeah, it was good, yo. Yeah, I, I can't throw it at first, but yeah, I, I caught on the yeah, later. Yeah, I yeah the whole TV, comments. the whole TV, or uh, the way for TV movie and all that shit. Yeah, I was skeptical, but that shit was really good. That man. shit was they, real good. I'm gonna watch it later, man. Like, yeah, I'm gonna wait. It's a must watch. Like that. That's what I get. But this is the same thing. I didn't go see Straight Outta Compton right away. Yeah, yeah I didn't go see it in the theater. I was like, I want all my, I want all my cousins and older brothers to go see it. Right, right, right. Because like I know Dre, but I know Dre from like the game. Right. And, you know, like, the chronic didn't mean much to me in 92 because I was nine. Right, right. See, that was my <laughs> shit. I remember having the chronic tape. I brought that shit home. True story. I brought the tape home. Somebody let me borrow the shit. My dad got wind of the shit, found the tape, nigga, and took the tape. <laughs> yeah. For so nigga went, yeah, yeah. So yeah. Nigga went back to school, like, yo, where's my tape? I'm like, yo, Pops got your shit. We come home every day. Pops is banging that shit. That shit was real. Mm-hmm. That's what's up. I guess for me, um, Shit, man, the chronic was like the soundtrack to my. Right. I might have been like, I had to be in junior high right. and shit. That's when we first started smoking, kicking right. it, right. fucking all that Snoop shit. Snoop Dogg was the shit. Happened all in that time, man. Right. That right. time frame. So Shout that shit's classic because it's them coming of the year, right. coming of right. age years for me. So yeah, so a lot of dope. memories, a lot of memories to the chronic. Definitely. But the, uh, the mm-hmm. movie straight out of Compton, it was all right. It was all right, mm-hmm. man. That, that shit's shit. in my top ten. That shit's yeah. right up there with Scarface with me. So yeah. was it better? Was New Edition better than that? Uh, right, they was on the same level. Same level. Oh, yeah, you bought the movie and everything. Same I forgot you went and bought the damn yeah, DVD yeah, and shit. Yeah. Blue I Ray, watched baby. the bootleg, my nigga. Blu ray. <laughs> See, when they come out with a soul for real biopic, yeah. that's what I'm getting like right there. That was, <laughs> that, that was, that was my age. <laughs> that's exactly. That shit's gonna be short. <laughs> it's gonna be, yeah, yeah. It's gonna be done. Show they right. met Heavy D. Uh, what happened after that? Right. They got the, the, that was uh, it. What's the Candy one Rain. Uh, it comes on fucking, uh, I forgot what channel, but they uh, do like show. Yeah, unsung yeah. about like, you know, shit that happens to the old groups and shit. Them niggas ain't even got an unsung. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, they, they don't. They don't. They don't. They, they, they should have short lived. Right. Yeah, hey, remember yeah. the boys? But that's good. Yeah. 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 What happened the to them? They moved to Africa. They're called the, uh, <laughs> the something men. men. Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah. They the grown men. men. The grown men. They what sh- happened? Who brought them out? No, they are the actual something men. Yeah. Who uh, brought them out? Like, who was responsible for the boys? The boys from men. Their dad. Yeah. Damn. Her dad was their manager. I don't know if he's like responsible or responsible, but right. he was like the one that mentored them and all yeah. that shit. They had like two hearts. They had uh, the Down My Heart, and then what yeah. else they had? They had like two hits. Or was that it? Yeah, Down My Heart was the big That one. was it. Yeah, the Down My Heart was their hit, but then I had the album and shit. Man. I had the album too. It was actually my cousins, man. Oh, yeah. really? What was this? Damn. But are they in Africa? Yeah, some of them are. Some of them are in Atlanta. Oh, okay. So Lyle and uh, so they, they all like had the still too. working. Yeah, yeah, I heard they like actually. They, I yeah, heard they actually tour bad. Africa, bro. They, they like got a group and they the pop, hot in Africa. The pops moved to Thailand, man. Yeah, oh, they got money. Oh, so they got some. Yeah, yeah, that's some yeah. different stuff. Like when you hear people move to like Thailand and right, like, right. Germany, yeah, yeah. it's like that's so, that's what I'm gonna do when I get my like, bread. I'm out. They got that, uh, what you call that shit where they're not a citizen anymore. They a sovereign uh, citizen, some shit. shit. Like, yeah, like, yeah. like most deaf, a right, world right. citizen, and Jay Rudy Damager. Right, right, right. Is most deaf back? Yeah, he's back. He's, he's back and forth. I don't yeah. think right. he got coming think under. He's, under he's yeah. able to get back though. Yeah, yeah. one time. Well, he, he ain't coming back now. Not with that bullshit. But they didn't ban yeah. the bullshit. But yeah, fuck that. I don't know if most stuff is back. I don't what, know either. Nigga nah, was twisted last night. Off the subject. Was twisted last night at who dance? I think he was. Okay. Twister or is it drunk. tonight? I don't know. Last night? One or the two. All right. It might have been last night though. I don't know though. Damn. Okay, I'm kind of I missed that. Who lands? Yeah, who lands? Downtown St. Paul. Twister and... Downtown St. Paul? Yes. Twister. Twister, Twister and Young Drug. <laughs> young Drug. That's a, that's a heck of a combination right there. Isn't it? Like, I'm going to think that. But it would be... I guess that would be fun. Like, I, I love watching Young Drug interviews. Yeah. Young Drug was hilarious, dude. Who lands? That's them on the phone. Uh, that's, uh, that was Mooja. That was actually Mooja on the uh, phone. We about to uh, see if he's hear? coming through. Should be here probably. We're about to get off live. We'll be back though. We'll be back. Tune in, please. I gotta make calls. Tune in. Or it's all. So we're still live. Fucking, I'm by myself live. Gotta go downstairs, but we gotta keep the feed going. This is the live as shit. So we got two guests today comedian Greg Coleman. We got Muja Messiah, and I think Maria Issa coming down. We're about to find out. Y'all follow me on the elevator. Literally, super live. 
I'm not even gonna cut the feed off. Had to interrupt shit and fucking do all kind of crazy shit, but we're still in here. Good morning. Everybody that's joining, fuck with it. Local celebrities podcast. I'm taking y'all downstairs to grab guests, then we're going back to the studio to keep it popping. Still live down here, waiting for my guests. I don't know where the hell they at. It's the life, man. The life of the podcast. Real life. Oh, come on. Still waiting for the guests. It's fucking live as fuck right here. I'm not even gonna lie to you. This is gonna be as live as y'all ever see this show. I'm not even gonna cut the shit. We ain't gonna cut the shit. We ain't gonna cut the crap. But I am waiting for my guests to get in. You're welcome. You're welcome. We've been live online. We wait for y'all. We upstairs. Back up here. Finding the live. This is the livest ever. <laughs> Trying to get this guy on the show. He's down here ordering coffees. <laughs> coffees and pastries. Let me ask you a question, America. Do you say caramel or do you say caramel? Caramel. That's gonna be topic as soon as we get back upstairs. Caramel and caramel. See, so yeah, we back. Live. Literally, this guy's getting his shit. We're going right back up to the studio. We're going to get back online, get back on the air, shoot this shit live, and that's what it's going to be all day. Yeah, man, this shit is super live. How you doing? Good to see you. Good morning. I didn't get the donuts or the coffee. I was late as hell. But we're still going to be live. Oh, man, I want the smoke, man. Man, after the interview, it's going to go down. How y'all doing? But still, y'all still with Local Celebrity Podcast. I had to come downstairs and grab my mans. I'm talking to everybody. Everybody that's everybody. joining the live feed, that fucks with us on the live feed. So we're going back upstairs. Depp still in the studio with the other guests we got today, comedian Greg Coleman. We're going to shoot back up here and talk a bunch of dumb, crazy shit. And uh, that's what the fuck we're going to do. I forgot my sunglasses in my hat. It's all right. We're still going to get it down. We're still going to get it down. Oh, for hey. I don't even smoke blunts, but I got some papers. You don't smoke blunts? No, I quit smoking blunts. What the uh, fuck? Why we can't get upstairs? I smoke uh, uh, Saka. He smokes it's, uh, raw paper. We smoked, raw papers. we smoked 20 raws last night. I didn't get high. Then we smoked one blunt. I got high. Wow. The power of the blunt. I quit blunts. No blunts, 2017. We're going to talk about that shit. No blunts, no cigarettes, brother. No tobacco. About to head back to the studio and get it popping. Live, KFAI. You're seeing it right now. We're walking right back to the studio. I'm going in live. Hopefully, my man's will let me in. We back in here. Oh, thank you, sir. The best. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. How you doing? Man? I'm going right back to the studio. Right, right. <laughs> right back to the studio. Right back to the live feed. No eating, drinking, or smoking. We're doing all the above. We're back up in this piece. Everybody's back. Go ahead, join the convo. Have a seat. Have a seat. We're right back in here. We just have guests coming all throughout the show. Guests are just popping in. It's going to happen, though. Gang signs in here, you guys. No, no, no. 
It is what it is. It is what it is. Get this man a headphones. I mean, here. Get this man some headphones. He said, watching the world start, man. Hey, World Star is the best shit ever, bro. World Star. Every day and going World Star, man. You know what, though? After a while, it has a negative effect on your psyche, bro. Yeah, when, it you does. Watch, when you watch niggas get hit by tigers and people get chopped by machetes, <laughs> yeah, yeah. shit ain't happening, bro. It it's not happy at all, but it's like, like, it's I like used to watch, I used to watch World Star every day, and then like a month and a half later, I felt there was something wrong with me, and I didn't yeah. know what it was, and, and I was kind of depressed, and I was sad, and I said, <laughs> Nigga, you're waking up and watching World Star. Tied morning. up in this motherfucker. Yeah. And it really, it really changed my life when I started watching, when I stopped watching. It. Oh, so you stopped completely? I stopped cold turkey, nigga. I watched it the other day <laughs> and watched the nigga uh, get ate by the lion. Oh, no, I didn't watch that one. I seen see the Chinese girl get flipped up on a fucking... On an amusement oh, ride, nigga, and I was done. After I right. seen the eight by line, I said, "That's why so I was done." Yeah, I'm done. <laughs> well, I used to like. Cause I'm like addicted to watching fights. Like yeah, I watch yeah, fights. Yeah, no fucking like twenty minute fights. long uh, fight compilation and shit. Cause like, I want to know what to do when you know what I mean. When the nigga yeah. wilds out. When I'm at Seven Eleven. Right, and the niggas got a problem. Cause I know how to fight people that I can beat up. Right. <laughs> Never <laughs> fight somebody that can beat you up. Right. You can tell by the demeanor and how they talk right, to you. Right, right, right. And right. that's when you do the my bad thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> see, I, I watch it for my girl's sake. Because I'm like, hey, she ain't been in no fights. So I'm like, like, you see what that girl did right there? The yeah, first thing they do is go for the hair. So you got to protect your hair. <laughs> like, hey, you see how... Well. Uh, yeah, like, hey, you see how she helped her boyfriend out when they were jumping him? That's the shit you got to do. I, I skipped Hey, like, we going out to right. downtown. Right. Minneapolis. We going out downtown Minneapolis tonight. And I'm gonna go home and put on some World Star fight because she's gonna be prepared, yeah. bro. So she's gonna be ready. Like the most That's the only time I'm sexist. Right. 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 So so when I watch girl fight, let bitch can't fight. I don't wanna watch that shit. So no Ronda Rousley's happening in the street. No, I'd be some bullshit happening though. I don't see some bitches get beat up like horrible, horrible well, shit. Like in real life. Real life, yeah, yeah real life. Like, get off her, damn! Somebody stop that shit, type shit. Yeah. Chicks yeah. can fight in a lot. Of, a lot of young chicks can fight now because of UFC shit. Yeah. Right, right. Well, young chicks want to be in the UFC. They want to be like dudes and beat bitches up like the studs. You ever seen the studs fight like a, a girly girl? <laughs> Studs fight like niggas out here, mounting them, hitting them in the face, shit like Arm that. Bars. You know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I seen them. Shout, Shout out to the stud fight. Shout out to the stud fight. Yeah, they in a street fight. Yeah, yeah, a half crazy Nelson shit. Fight. Type of nigga tap out. Yeah, you can tap out. Then you it's stop. a street fight, nigga. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Though? <laughs> <laughs> it, 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 can you tap out in the street fight? Do niggas stop the fighting? I don't think so. If you got a homeboy there, they're like, hey, right, man, right, hey, right. Hey, hey, stop them out, stop them out, stop them out. You gotta, fights, have, a, you man, gotta have a mutual friend in the, there <laughs> right. on, on that. Right. That's but man, hey, you came in. Uh, about to have some you came in, man. People might fights. not know the voice. Go ahead and introduce yourself, my friend. Uh, my name is Robin Williams. <laughs> A.K.A. Uh, A.K.A. The Man Back from the Dead. Uh, A.K.A. A.K.A. Muja Masai. A.K.A. Mm. A.K.A. Mm. Uh, the Milano Trump supporter. Damn. Damn. Gave it to him. Raw. See? That was raw as fuck. Damn. We just was just talking about Trump. I was going to say, <laughs> just kidding. We just fucked, fucked the mood up, man. Right, right. Hey, hey niggas is crazy. breaking up. Well, they, well, motherfuckers is fighting. Uh, fighting their brothers and sisters, breaking up with their bitch over. Uh, nigga, I got a, nigga, I got on all Ivanka Trump clothes. <laughs> yeah, right. That's just on sale right now on clearance. Right now, nigga, I got this man like your eight. <laughs> 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 eight at Burlington. Hey, that bitch's clothes is going straight to Burlington. Hell yeah, yeah from no, North that Shums, shit, No, nigga, that's just going to Shums Africa to with the motherfucking Atlanta Falcons shirts. 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 Atlanta Falcons Shout Niggas gonna have on a Ivana Trump and motherfucking uh, <laughs> Falcons uh, on 2017 Super yeah, Bowl hey, shirts. I remember when Top Tone printed up like 2000 uh, <laughs> Championship Vikings oh, yeah. uh, t shirt. And the nigga missed the field goal. Oh, uh, the, yeah. the NFC, uh, yeah, that yeah, was, I think that yeah. was 98. That was 98. That was against the Falcons. Gary, yeah, Gary, 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 Gary. Uh, Vikings championship. Yeah, he's about to fucked come up. up. Yeah, he's about to come up, though. You know, it's fucked up. At the, when that day that, day, that day that shit happened, I was at the Metrodome working for the Pioneer Press where they had the, the fucking papers. Saying the Vikings are winning. Yeah. <laughs> they wow. we outside there, just like, man, yeah. see people come out, be like, oh, we about to get these papers. Like, we come out, motherfucker. Right. Hanging their head down and shit. We heard it on the radio. Damn. Now I'm like, ah, oh, motherfucker, we threw all the papers and that shit was Yo, filled just, with hundreds and hundreds of new papers. Signed, um, the Seahawks just signed Blair Walsh, and oh. I predict that next year the Seahawks will 
kick the Vikings out of the playoffs with a Blair with Walsh a field, field With a field goal. Exactly. That'd, be, that'd be karma. Exactly. That'd be karma. That sounds about right. That's damn near like the Cavaliers and that Golden State Warriors shit. And that get to me with, uh, you guys think the uh, Super Bowl was rigged this year? No, nah. no, nah. nah. nope. the election wasn't rigged, the Super Bowl wasn't rigged, nothing is Rich. fixed. Hey, man, I don't White know. people are just strong <laughs> it's time and to powerful. Shine. I don't know, bro. <laughs> There's some questionable <laughs> shit that happened to the Super Bowl. <laughs> You're looking at other hey, Patriots. Well, There's a lot of questionable shit. Hey, I was too. I'm a Brady fan, but I, did, I was like, I'm not man. a fan, but I don't bet against Brady like, and Belichick. Fuck, I don't yo. ever bet against him. I don't I don't know, my my homie told me, they was like, B, man, you're kind of like, you know what I mean? You're kind of like a, a hip-hop Tom Brady type nigga. Yeah. Like, I don't know what the fuck is that mean. Nigga got a, uh, but I can make it as a compliment. Right. You're you a champion. Love, I love Brady. Man. Right. You, you, uh, you hey, a I've been a Brady fan since Michigan, man. I liked the Patriots when they had Drew Bledsoe, but that motherfucking Super Bowl, yo, I don't know, man. Niggas, sketchy niggas, shit, niggas used to like trend. Mateen Cleaves more than Tom Brady. <laughs> that is true. At a, point, at a point in life. Yeah, at a point, 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 point in life. How are those two even compared? Right. Right. It's both in Michigan. Oh, Michigan, Michigan, Michigan State. State. Michigan. Right. Michigan State, Michigan. Yeah, they have nothing to do with each other. Yeah, no. no. <laughs> Mateen Cleaves. Though. Shout out to Mo P, though. Motherfucking Mateen Cleaves. I don't know what the fuck he's up to. Ain't it crazy how you could dominate college and win a championship and then go to the league and play for two years and no one ever hears about you. Nobody ever player. hears about you again. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's the setup. That's kind of what happened with uh, uh, Khalid El Amin too, man. Like he had even Kinda. his first year, Kinda. he had a good rookie season too, though. So that nigga like kind of dropped out. Yeah, yeah. like, man. He, right. he, he fell off the radar. Season, you know, he but he been overseas making money for 20 years. Hey, man, listen, man, we trying to get like, you on the show, man. 20 years. Yeah, I heard he was like the Jordan the Turkey or some shit like that. Then he finally, he came back to yeah, watch his son. He's here, man. Him, he him and t from the next, years. they went overseas <laughs> and played in Greece. <laughs> 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 Watch me. Oh my god. Once my show fails, I'm going overseas. Yeah, man, where's Greg? I, I don't know. Shit. I heard he is in Amsterdam. Yeah. <laughs> Doing shows. Living I'm moving to Brazil, man, and getting AIDS and shit. I'm going to be there. <laughs> this, oh, this, this nigga wants Zika. No, nah, man. This I'm nigga want to go catch hey, Zika. He want a Zika baby hey, with I, AIDS. I forgot to wear my hat. If I hey, ever. It was that same fucking hat. Ain't that crazy? That's, That's good. good. Hey, if I was ever divorced, <laughs> like if guy. I ever get a divorce, bro, I'm moving that to Brazil, and I'm this going to hide it. Fuck it. <laughs> I took it out your back. See, you're lucky. Right, right, right. Y'all would have been awkward as fuck. You, you look Brazilian, but as soon as you start see, talking, they're going to be like, where is this no, nigga? No, I'm going to fake it, man. They're going to be like, oh, hey, what time is it? Like, hey, you a dark Hey, when niggas get thrown out of town, they sound Minnesota. They do. Hey, they sound like... Hey, they can sound Minnesotan when they say Minnesota. 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 Man, where you from? Oh, I'm from so. Minnesota. Hey, you yeah. got an accent. And that shit. And that shit is real, though. Real. I, didn't, I didn't realize that shit. And it's real. It is real. Nigga got that hard accent. We got that hard old. Oh, right. right. And stretch the oh. old lingo. Right. Like, oh, I'm Minnesota. And it gets worse when you leave and shit. Yeah, I do. Like, I'll be going to Wisconsin, and my girl like, I don't understand you when we go home. What the fuck are you talking about? She lives with, or her parents in Wisconsin. Whenever we go there, uh-huh. she says she doesn't understand me anymore. Like, what the fuck are you talking? You talking like, yeah, to you talk different, man. you know? You talk different around white people. And Nigga, shit. My, my slang is gentrified. Right. <laughs> Could be. It's ebonics. 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 Man, yeah, shit's going down. Two guests today, man. We went from no guests. We had the fall off show last week. We went from no guests, man, to two guests. So this is all the makeup. Yes, no, it's the makeup show. Literally, shout out to Tecate. Like, we drinking Tecate. This shit is delicious. Yeah. It's hot. It's, it's early morning. Niggas drinking light beer. I didn't eat shit yet. Anybody eat anything this we morning? Ate. We ate. I don't, you know, I, don't, I, don't, I don't usually eat till like 6 p.m. anyway. Right, Fam, I didn't eat this shit. is a, whoever graphic designer you, uh, did this is amazing. Look black, at this logo. Yeah, it's the, it's the black. You're, uh, well, you're uh, eat fast, black eagle. You fasting, my dude? Oh. Said he said his beard looks fat. Ooh, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, right, right. It is. It is. Fast beard. It is. Nah, and it is. Ain't that the motherfucking, uh... It's the uh, Black Eagle, baby. No, nigga, that's the fucking... That's somebody listening. logo. The, uh, uh, Aryan Nation logo, nigga. Oh, that's shit! That's it. That's it. The fucking ego, yo. The outline of the that's ego. eagle. That's the fucking no, ego, yo. that's the fucking... I was just Nazi watching Hate Thy Neighbor, bro. And that's the ego that nigga was crafting. This uh, nigga just ain't drinking racist beer. Yeah, we just really finished. That's good, though. Yeah. <laughs> that nigga <laughs> voted for Trump, bro. 
Google, like Google, a, hey, like Google real life version. Tecate Trump. Trump. Hey, let's Google this. Is the, the, is the Tecate logo racist? <laughs> yeah. I hope not. Is this so a real life version of Black Dynamite beer, right, right now? Did we just break down the beer. Shout out to Tecate, y'all. I only say that because I was watching that Hate Thy Neighbor shit, and this is the exact fucking shadow and thing they were using right here. Did you see Black Dynamite? Yeah, the movie? Like the movie? This, is, this is the exact same thing. It's yeah. the beer. This is Anaconda yeah. liquor. This is the real Anaconda oh, liquor. That's fucked up. To be contentious. Yeah. Yeah. Black Diamond, my George is Black Diamond, my cut. No, they, George is Luke Cage. I know you're tired of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but Luke you Cage, really right. are, though. You look at that nigga don't wear no black hoodies. <laughs> Sweet Christmas. <laughs> that's it. Sweet that's Christmas. Why right. That's why he said, I gotta get a gray hoodie, no black hoodies. <laughs> Tell them girls all the time, you wanna go get some coffee? <laughs> right, right, right. Get some coffee. Look, Tecate, top 10 racist booze advertisements. Shut you. up. Yeah. Damn, why I why you get that off the end. Google's got one dick in this man. <laughs> <laughs> short circuit everything. Think about the short circuit everything. Oh, man. This shit is not good. I'm looking. I'm looking right now. It's, it's, I, see, like I just, I don't, it, you know, even if something's racist, if you enjoy the product and you like it, and the customer yeah, service is okay, right? Who cares if it's racist? Like Timberland, like, it's like, just like Timberland, like, yeah, like right. Polo, like, like the LA Clippers for tons of years. Right, right. It's the exact same thing. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's stressful. Like Walmart, right? Like, <laughs> right, like we still don't enjoy Blake Griffin jumping yeah. over a kill, yeah, like yeah, just because right. his owner was racist. Yeah. What happened to Blake Griffin? Huh? He's back. He's, yeah, he's healthy. I, say, he's I don't even watch too. basketball no more, man. I Doing do, the man. same thing. Only college, so only college thought, basketball. Why do I think the All Star weekend was this weekend? What happened to Blake Griffin was when you Thanks. realize you can't just jump over people to score. He fell you gotta off. have skills. <laughs> <laughs> They're talking about training him for uh fucking um. Shit, who they talking about? Kevin or Carmelo Anthony? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. thought Melo was going to the Cavs. No, that was got it. I was the first there talking about Carmelo for him. Ain't it funny how you you wouldn't trade Kevin Love for? Blake Griffin or Carmelo Anthony now, like Kevin Love. He's got his stock went up. Yeah, stock went up. He left here. Everybody leaves the Minnesota about and your stock. Carmelo goes. Anthony, they don't got no basketballs to go around for him to, to leave, leave Minnesota. And they got to get 50 himself. shots off to make 20 points. That's true. Melo's a ball. <laughs> but <laughs> black nah, he'll play the role. Hey, you remember when they were trying to get him and Kobe on the team together? Nigga, that was never. That gonna shit happen. wasn't going. The niggas gonna have right, 100 right, shots. Right, right, right. Between each other, they, they, they gotta so literally great. play with two basketballs. Hey, that nigga Carmelo don't, don't have no skin showing. His whole <laughs> whole all this is shit is all. Hey, that nigga's a mummy. The legs, <laughs> his legs, his arms, forearms, everything's wrapped up. You, you ain't lying. Damn, nigga playing stretchy uh and yeah. spandex. That nigga's in long johns. <laughs> About, uh, I don't know, that's tough to go get that championship or just stay in New York and just ride it out because, like, he's the new Jeter in New York. Right, yeah. Like, he, he, like he's the, the, the just premier. They just set him up. He's it's the premier team, athlete. Though. Right. But in it, New I York thought City. they set him up, though. They so brought uh, Derek Rose and shit. Man, that's Przingis. You know what? That's Christoph Przingis' team right now. Yeah. He's balling. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out to the New York Knicks, man. Yeah. Four finger, four fingers. Super Bowl finger roll, coming boys, to Minnesota. Fingers. Who's going? Y'all going to the Super Bowl? Definitely not. No, you ain't spending fifteen hundred for a ticket. I go to. I'm going to NFL experience though. I'm yeah. getting fifteen thousand. Fifteen thousand for yeah, a ticket? Yeah, yeah there ain't gonna be no fifteen hundred dollars. Yeah, that's gonna be bullshit. Tickets. I heard you can get a, month, a nosebleed for fifteen hundred. I'm gonna fuck with the NFL experience though, man. Yeah. Last time the Super Bowl was here. Yeah. I went to that shit when I was a kid, man. I met right. motherfucking the same day, nigga. Met Muhammad Ali. Walter Payton, right? Meldrick Taylor, right? Uh, I met my Warren Moon, and Walter Payton, and fucking uh, Willie Go. That's that was right. all the same day, bro. Damn. I used to love Legends. Willie Go. Hell yeah, that nigga. Legends. And he was racing. He was running too. He was. Uh, they had like the little mock forty yard dash thing there, yeah. and he was racing the fan. And so like, ah oh, man, this is. I'm in. I'm in heaven right now, right, yo. You, that's the real. But, uh, you had the real fucking. That nigga got uh, the eighty five bears. No man, Mark, fucking. That was uh, the illest thing. Nigga, they had the Super Bowl shuffle. I mean, yeah, no, I, not, not Warren Moon, Randall Cunningham. Shoes. That nigga curved me too, man. I was so heated. <laughs> Come on, Warren Randall Cunningham. No, hey, no, Randall, Randall brother. <laughs> so he had, yeah, he had like a line to go meet him, get the autograph and shit. Right. I was from from me to Moose, y'all. And as soon as it, he got to the dude right there, he's like, yeah, I'm done. <laughs> like, oh, this nigga you crushed my dreams, bro. Yeah, Fuck when I was a shorty, I met <laughs> Babyface and Johnny Gill at the, the uh, airport, and Babyface wouldn't give me an autograph, and then Johnny Gill so did. So did. And then. <laughs> yeah, oh, oh, you gotta know about Johnny Gill. <laughs> hey, they call this him, interview's uh, over. <laughs> <laughs> hey, they call Johnny Gill the, uh, the uh, male superhead, bro. You know I, heard some, shit? I heard some nasty shit. Hey, I've been going in a, about Johnny Gill, but I, I, I ain't want to believe it. I ain't want to believe Johnny it. Johnny Gill, Sugar Ray Leonard, 
Arsenio Hall and motherfucking Eddie yeah, Murphy. Yeah, that was you talking about sex. Yeah, they got a sex, uh, yeah. sex, sex yeah, circle. Yeah, no, a circle, sugar bro. Litter. A circle jerk. They, they was holding. <laughs> basically, <laughs> them three niggas was passing Johnny Gill around, man. But hey, this nigga, hey, you know, Eric Eric Johnny got them like my, 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 You know how they did Superhead where one nigga, then they, they sent her around, they did that's that with Johnny Gill, man. That's fucked up. Sugar See, Litter and Eddie Murphy. was so nice at the beginning talk about the new edition story shit like that. I'm glad they ain't put that shit in the movie. Don't Don't take this. Yeah, still watch the movie. Still watch oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Don't let him fuck hey, up. Hey, remember Johnny Star? I think I want to watch the Jodeci movie. It's the be the Jodeci story? Coke. Hey, yeah, that'd be hell. Yeah, that'd be hell. Coke the fuck out. Mary J. Blige. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to say Mary J. Blige in her ass. Oh, man, that'd be horrible. That'd be horrible. That would be a dope movie, though. What's ever happened to the fourth nigga from Jodeci, man? Darwin. 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 Yeah, look, Darwin. He called that nigga Darwin. Hey, this nigga with the backpack. He never did nothing. That nigga yeah. disappeared, yo. Don't he play the drums? Hey, don't sleep. Mr. Dowd. He wrote. did. Yeah, he played. Song. No, that nigga had, uh, he had a song out He later. had one song. Yeah, that nigga act- was playing the drums, acting crazy. Look that shit up. Yeah, he did. He had, a, he had a song where he played the drums singing. That nigga was playing the no drums one crazy. No gonna look that shit up. Man. Hey, <laughs> if you get a chance and you want to see where he's at, that's where he's at. Devontae, Devontae, Devontae was the first Chris Brown. Yeah, Devontae? he was. Yeah, he was. Devontae Swing? Yeah, that nigga was out here wilding out. Who he got a kid with, man? Don't he got a lot. He got a kid with. Don't he got a kid with T. Boz, nigga? Is yeah, that who it is? Nigga, man. That nigga was oh, 19. Yeah, yeah, that's 19. Oh, okay, bro. yeah. Max like, used to beat up T-Bow. I used to hate I that mean, nigga for that. To this day, I, I ain't gonna beat up T-Bow. <laughs> the 20 seconds <laughs> Niggas get his Dr. Dre on. Oh, oh, hey, that was, was fucked up, too. Dr. Dre hey, you talk up, about so. losing your shape and not being the same nigga. That nigga t buzz does not look like t buzz Oh, yeah, she's, yeah, she's, 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 she's up, yeah. super <laughs> auntie out, man. Her shit, her shit, uh, raspy like this nigga shit, right, not too. Right. She's like, hey, nigga. <laughs> party, t buzz quit partying. Because, yeah, I'm sounding like... Chili's still funny. Yeah, she looks good. She, she looked the fucking same. She gotta be like down there fifty by now. Oh, chili. She looked the same. Yes, yeah, as did. when she got she got famous. the Indian skin. Hell yeah, <laughs> yeah her, she's, little she's Indian not, girl. Yeah, hell yeah, she's tough. Chili said Indian. Yeah, and then Usher man, fucked that shit up, bro. And she's always been my favorite. Usher blew it. Yeah, he did. Usher's doing just fine. Chili, only motherfucker that they had six packs. You crazy? Since 1993. You don't know if I was doing okay, huh? Just because he doesn't have chili. He's hurt. I think chili over the money, nigga. How many dudes have had a Halle Berry have left her? I'm pretty sure they're doing a whole nother Right. right. Chili might be the same thing. Just yeah, she got the Halle Berry pussy. That shit's rotten or something. Nigga, if you, oh, walk, if, if, if you walked in and Gucci man was fucking you, you wouldn't fuck with her. You know Gucci fucked Chili a long time. Did he? Never knew that. The, which one, the Gucci with the belly or the skinny Gucci? But with the belly, the belly the nigga, head, big Gucci, oh, the ham bone, <laughs> ham bone, herring bone. Gucci. Yeah, he fucked yeah. chili too. That's probably why I also left. He oh, was yeah. like, he, he left the chicken wing. He fucking that ugly ass nigga. He left the chicken bone. And Man, you know everybody. <laughs> you know everybody in Minneapolis fucks the same. <laughs> Fuck everybody fucking in Minneapolis. You know in Atlanta, nigga, everybody's really fucking. They're fucking everybody in circles. circles, circle jerk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we don't know. Crazy. Chili might be somebody's mother. I'm sorry. She, she, she right. had a kid with she is. Uh, Dallas man. She, Dallas Austin. She, she, yeah, Dallas. Dallas Austin she was did. the second Chris uh, Chris Brown, my nigga. That nigga was getting it. He was fucking all, uh, all the Chinese. Everybody they got burnt that nigga's house down. To LA, to LA face. He was hitting him. He was hitting him. Mm. True stories. This is unheard shit right here. They need to do more uncut just about motherfuckers who really, really fell off. Like... Not like Chris Cross Skilo. story. Not like shit. Yeah, I want there to be the Skilo story. Skilo. They might have had one. They might already have one. <laughs> Which I, I had the ball. Right, right. Shit I like that. Theory. I want to know what happened to certain motherfuckers, man. Because nobody yeah, I have got that. taller. He Listen, right. right. <laughs> what happened to Shaq? Like that was my Shaq G story. Like play that shit. He's still in Germany, bro. Probably. probably still getting paper, bro. He's got way getting paper out of motherfucking his radio spins. Probably still yeah, shit like that. Residuals. You ever think about this story? I have a theory about Skilo and his and his song. I wish, like, I, like I, I would love to be in the studio with him right. during that song, like his entourage. Uh, Cause he's like, yo, we gonna go opposite. Everybody like talking good about yourself. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know, try to say something shitty. Like I wish I was taller. Right. So, like I wish the boys of his boys is like chiming in, like, yo, you don't get no bitches either. <laughs> right, right, nigga. Like, wish talk you had about some that. more bitches. Like, you wish you had some more right, bitches. Because the whole song is a short, three minute diss song on himself. Came short. It's a three minute diss song on himself. Right, right. Like, what was... Why do we like that shit? I do I that wish though. it was a little bit We need more. We, we, we need more 
modest. I like, like that shit. Like, I think it was like, just that's a what I was just trying to figure out. Like, I was a high as hell. Like, they got a three minute diss song to you. Right, right, right. Yeah. He did that shit. He did that shit. You got to scoot back a little bit. You clipping the mic, bro. Oh shit! Nigga, I'm sorry, <laughs> nigga. I'm sorry. Nah, nah, you good? Is it just me? That nigga's in there like one well, fucking uh, like a, a mariachi. Uh, yeah, you, hey man, <laughs> that's that's like that's you don't do. you don't like that because you are a rapper and that's not that's what? not your your field of like self deprecation. No, I like self deprecation. I like I like uh, when people are honest about their feelings. That song sucks though. Yeah, the song. <laughs> like the, song. Fucking song. the ideal, yeah. the ideal. Like I said, I'll, I'll do like a song like that, like. Your fucking shortcoming. Nigga, when the shit comes I on, used to want to be short when yeah. I was when I was a shorty. Why like, though? Because like Bruce Lee. <laughs> like <laughs> short niggas can whoop ass. Like Natron means. Nigga, right. Short hey, nigga, yeah, nigga used to have gas. Short niggas gas. equal motherfucking domestic violence. DJ right? Doge. Short, right? <laughs> short <laughs> niggas <laughs> equal <laughs> domestic violence. Yeah, because the girl gonna pressure you. That's fucked up. The girl gonna pressure you if you short. She gonna try you. Hey, some little man said. Little nigga. Right, little man said. You gotta be play fighting and be sweating. Right. Man, every short nigga I know starts some shit. Right. Them niggas right. troublemakers. Yeah. Man. I can agree. Every little nigga is a trouble nigga, a troublemaker, bro. I can agree. And Some niggas be, be so short, sure you just feel sorry. For Hell yeah, them niggas I know, but the niggas be the first ones ready to fight and shit. Hell yeah. Though. You know what I mean? They gotta beat up nobody. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Niggas they are gotta point the shit. Right, right. Like, come on, man. Yeah, come on with the bullshit. Yeah. Them niggas will beat a bitch up quick, though. Yeah, that was a good point. Yeah. Like, bitch, I'm still a man. Right, right. Right, right. And they be having the biggest bitches, though. Hell yeah. Man, you're impressed. You ain't lying. Yeah, right there. You ain't lying. <laughs> Shout out to all the niggas under five four <laughs> with domestics. So that's we were talking about that last, up. that one, the uh, other week with fucking Razzcats. That nigga was like five foot tall. Yeah, we was. That nigga was little as shit, yo. Yeah, niggas that appear to be and, big, and that nigga real game life. beat him up, man. That's fucked up. That was yeah, fucked. Yeah, that's child abuse. That's, that's funny. The when I met him, that's the first thing I thought. Of. Like, man, this nigga game beat this dude up. Game be out here beating up short little niggas and going over taking dick pics. That was a Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> Type of nigga are you, man? You no, I wouldn't want to be no short guy, though, man. You, know, you got to fight. Every yeah. day I got to fight. Right, right, right. <laughs> All my life I had to fight, man. How tall is Kendrick? He's a little motherfucker. Kendrick is... Man, most rappers little, aren't short as shit, bro. He's right. A little, he's a little shorter he's than... He's like five, uh, six, maybe. It's like Big Sean. Remember, y'all seen Big Sean when he was here? <laughs> yeah. And yeah, that nigga was little... Like, like, uh, and and so you that you couldn't see that nigga. And you hear that nigga's new song? That nigga said, I'm on my balls. I know my balls. I got my balls. I got my balls. I got my balls. I said, this nigga just put Drake's dick down his throat. I heard that it was the other way, though. I heard Drake stole his shit. No, he stole... I heard Drake stole the fly shit like... Like, he stole uh, the rhyme like, scheme like all a motherfucker. Yeah. Scrolled him. They said <laughs> Ludacris said he started that. Oh, the super thing. It and was all, yeah, the super thing. Yeah, the Q-tip. Yeah, Q-tip yeah, yeah. yeah. shot yeah. both the niggas down and said, I started that shit. Oh, Q-tip? That's what he yeah. said. Yeah. I heard it was Don't from Q-tip. Don't you remember Big Sean? Then I heard it was from Big Sean. Then Drake started it. Basically, the first, basically, they fighting over the first nigga to use a metaphor, a simile, without saying like. Right, 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 right. It's comparison. Like it's going down, basically. Right, right. Yeah. Like yeah, the blue balloon. Uh, paint the See? town red. Pyro. Ooh, Pyro. Fuck, man. Man, rap sucks, bro. Yeah, it does. I was watching Noisy. I was watching Noisy. Yeah, look. I was watching, you know what's yeah, fucked up? Rap sucks so bad that I actually started like fucking uh, Young Thug, man. Because like, of the I'm Noisy documentary. Like, so <laughs> Me too. I was like, maybe I, like, I got the like, wrong idea. Yeah, maybe he isn't that bad, man. Yo, he grew up rough. He grew up rough, man. Young Thug is like old dirty bastard. But that nigga wore a dress, though, bro, on his album cover, man. He wore a dress. Like, that's not a problem for me. Killer Mike defended that shit. You don't like that? You don't like that? He's like, Killer Mike does yeah, I'm a fucking, uh, I'm not a homophobe, but uh, shit, men don't wear. I'm not a homophobe. I'm, a, I'm an Islamophobe. Yeah, yeah. Who else? Yo, like, Islam. Hey, hey man, men can wear whatever they want, man. <laughs> I wore a dress one time, man, when I was like fucking twelve. Man. And you ain't even get a black record out of it. So what you talking about, dog? This nigga said I wore a dress one time. I ain't gonna lie, when I was twelve. Hey, uh, we had a, we had a, uh, we had a family talent show, man, and I dressed up like in, uh, uh, fucking in Vogue, man, in the same. He was my the first Medea. Then I felt bad. Hey, did you see he's ever gonna get it? And I'll still be the nigga uh, up there. Uh, yeah. that, no, not that. What's up? Uh, even worse. Uh, uh, what's up? What's up? I'm not even say? saying what's up. What's up? Because I'm worse than that. Oh, I'm going to kill him happy. No. I'm still bad. Right. Yeah, the sound. No, I think it was worse than that, man. 
Oh, you never not. told was, America you, you, that you don't hey, want a man I, to wear a dress, but you wore one when you were 12. I did, and did in both. It was in front of the family, nigga, not in front of the world. My country, 12 years old, is right. He's like, yeah, I should have got punched in my mouth when He's keeping it real. I'll ask you this question. What other Young Thug album cover do you remember? I don't remember any Young Thug. I did. Do you remember the one with the dress? I three Young Thug songs, period. Does he even have it? That is the first album, wasn't it? The mixtape, whatever. You know what the dress is? The album. The barter. You're forever going to remember that. Hey, niggas be seeming like overnight successes, then you go to their YouTube page, and they got 42 mixtapes out. And you're like, oh, okay. Like little Uzi Vert. Where did this nigga come from? Oh, okay. Man, but everybody's co-signing Young Thug, man. Fucking T.I., motherfucking Jeezy. Because Young Thug's bars is cold. He raps four bars. Bars this way, then for six, you don't have this way, then for eight, then for this, and then you don't know what he's saying. My craft, you don't know what he's saying, but yeah, he got he got a style though, right? He got a little cool. He definitely got a style. Hey, and the same nigga is responsible. The same two niggas responsible for all these dudes. Migos, Young Thug. They call it quality music of all things. Yeah, where they from? The A, Atlanta. These dudes found all of They found fucking Yachty. But that's the thing though. That's Atlanta.
Who has a must somebody in Zinc and Joe radio show? Like, right. Wow. That's nigga, you know you're like that? my rap skit Jones. Yeah, that's what I'm going to say. You got to like rap. But do your own. I never knew about this shit. Why ain't y'all niggas telling me? That child ugly. Child ugly <laughs> must the fucking owner. What's that? It's magic. I'm going to have to keep you up on track, bro. You got a smart phone. You got to stay woke, nigga. That's what it is. Everybody got to be woke out here. And by woke, I mean turn it into a phone zone. Right, right, right. Right, right. Stay on your phone. You got to watch fucking Rose Star, man. I'm busy at Work, my nigga. It's been two years. Two busy been at two work. years since I watched it. Yeah. Y'all sleep, man. We're all the same. You share the shit. You know the funny thing about World Star? See, that's where y'all was mistaken. You don't gotta click on anything on there. You, you know, can pick and choose the shit you want to click on. That's, so, that's the if, issue. So you don't though. want to see the fight. You don't want to see the computer shit. It's not. It's just like bad that the owner died. He was forty. That was a little night. He was watching World Star. Heart attack. Heart attack. Heart attack. Heart attack. That's it. Like I started feeling, I started feeling weird about it. Like it's almost like World Star is almost like watching too much porn. Like it's yeah. not it's like good. Over. Take like you all go blind. Yeah, soul. like it's just like <laughs> you know how people soul. say. Like you said, like yo, you don't have to watch the videos. It's like people are like yo, I'm on Facebook. You don't have to comment on my page. Right. Yeah, but I see it, and right. it's it's invoking something in me. And like you end up in these World Star twos where it's like yo, I'm down the rabbit hunnel. Like, why am I looking at this? Like, stuff that yeah, used to be. You, you remember Faces of Death? No remember the uh, uh, so Faces of Death shit. used to be the craziest yeah, yeah, yeah. thing? <laughs> <laughs> and you would have to VHS it. Right. Hey, you uh, click now on, you, you can click, click on, it on you your click phone. On, okay, Lung Thug got a new video. Next thing you know, mm -hmm. you're watching some chick put period blood in her man's cereal. Right, right, right. See, man, World I don't be clicking on all that. So you're a stronger man than me. Yeah, I can't do it, You're just stronger than I am. I see the headline first. I spent a lot of time reading the headlines. I'm like, yeah. I don't feel like being mad as fuck right now, so I ain't gonna watch no cop shootings. And I'll be like, ah. Don't read the comments. Never. Why do, why do oh, no, that's the best thing about World Star is the fucking saying, comments, yo. Why do people watch the videos? videos is, on, on, YouTube, on, on, on World Star, yes. Man, YouTube, niggas are don't funny as fuck on World Star, yo. They be coming up with jokes. Damn, the last video I told you I watched Speaking it said warning, and I still watched it. Speaking that of that, movie, that when you killed. had a uh, video on World Star, did you watch the comments? Yeah. Man, it was killing me. Yeah, I, I, I put up the It Goes Down. And nigga yeah, said, it, it goes down in the booty. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it goes down in the booty hole, nigga. I think I saw Larry Fishburne. He's like, Ugh. Yeah, that was that it. It's a Larry Fishburne right that now. Was that was that was there was a point in my life where I couldn't read the comments. There was a point in my life where I didn't want to record with niggas in the room now. Now, man, look. It, I don't care what you man, that shit about. is funny, though, yo. That's I called 30. A, I have an agenda. That's <laughs> yeah. called 40, my nigga. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out I to got, I don't care what anyone thinks 30. about anything. Right. I, by the time I'm 50, so I'm just going to start spitting people's faces. <laughs> that shit's hey, that's, that's, that's So I'm you got to take that shit to entertain like, value, and I'll take that shit personally. And when I'm 60, people are going to oh. tell me they're pretty, and I'm just going to die. Because <laughs> <laughs> probably probably going to come back to life when they leave. I don't give a fuck. Because yeah. actually got the like, commentary. Is this the nigga telling me his opinion? It's more funny than the video. Yeah, like, exactly. Like, that's what I will say. Like, world star, them kids. The niggas just make them comments for like, fucking low-budget comedians. Yeah, they are. Niggas be quick, I don't know how niggas This is so... Shit, the quickest yeah, 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 We had yeah. a conversation as like uh Tom hey, Segura the other day, and we were talking about how funny like black Twitter yeah. and black Instagram are, like the comments that these kids have and so quick. Yeah. And it's just like shit, like I can never come up with that. <laughs> like I can never age, come man. up they with wait, this. Nigga, they wait. Wait. It's like it take me yeah. three months to come up well, with this right. joke, yeah, this right. bit, and they're just like, oh, something happened. That's the problem. Bow, that's that's the problem with old comedians, new comedians now, because like Mike Epson them and Bill Burr, so they're like and like mm -hmm. we're 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 the generation where we had to go on the road to build yeah. a fan base, and it would take us two or three years. Now yeah, you can right. post that a funny yeah, video on it. Instagram, so, and, and that's why they got beef with them Kevin Hart's yeah. and the uh, and Dane Cooks. I don't know. Let's let's get let's get into comedy a little bit. Let's get into comedy because that's funny you say that. Because I'm going to a comedy show tonight. You going tonight? Oh, that uh, is tonight. Where's that? Michael Blackson and uh, no, no, at uh, State oh, Theater. Right, right, right. So that's there. Man, Corey Holcomb. Corey Holcomb. Uh, what? Uh, Cheryl Underwood, Cheryl. What? Michael Blackston. What? And DC Young Just Fly. Yeah, yeah, see, that's what I was getting at. He's, DC yeah, yeah. Young Fly, is he even a comedian? How, where did he become uh, a comedian? Uh, well, he, goes, he, was, he, he was just on Instagram, but I, I, did see, I did see an interview with this.